You just listened to a multi-track symphony orchestra piece composed entirely by AI. This is actually the 10th transformer based model to be able to do this based on large language models. This is actually using music as its notation, of course, as its training data set. It uses the same architecture as other language models like GPT-3 and Megatron and Gopher. It's just that this new data set is made up of thousands of pieces of music. The method is compatible with pop music as well. In fact, any genre. And just yesterday, the research director of DeepMind told us that the game is over. It's all about scaling now. In a different life, more than a decade ago, I spent time with some of the major symphony orchestras around the world, many of them requiring their sound engineers to have a music degree. I was head of sound at the Sydney Opera House, I mixed the orchestra for big Lloyd Webber shows, and was system engineer for David Newman, who re-recorded his dad's 20th century Fox theme, plus composed a few film soundtracks. See where I'm going with this? These guys dedicate their entire lives to creating visceral music, including composers and conductors like Dudamel here. It turns out none of that matters. AI is going to augment us in creativity as well. All the music you're hearing under this video was generated by an AI called SymphonyNet, released this month in May 2022. The researchers are from three institutions, the Conservatory of Music in Beijing, Oxford University and Tsinghua University. The researchers built their own music language data set based on nearly 50,000 high quality multi-track MIDI files with 279 million notes. The results were unbelievable. They sat down 50 people to test the AI music versus human made music. They chose 25 professional musicians and 25 non-musicians and they allowed them to rate the tracks based on these various ratings. The study found that excerpts generated by our models surpass the human compositions in the indicator of diversity. In other words, for some metrics, professional musicians preferred the music generated by AI. The study concluded that SymphonyNet can generate coherent, novel, complex and harmonious symphony compared to human composition. The pieces you're listening to today were all composed in multi-track by the SymphonyNet transformer model, which outputs MIDI control files. This is the 127 notes, plus it also has a lot of other control signals in there. These files can be converted to musical scores for real human orchestras to play, or the files could be fed through any music performance software. The choice of performance software determines how the score sounds. So some of the music bed in this video is with lower quality MIDI music performance software. Here is the highest quality performance output I could find from the researchers. It uses better orchestral instruments in macOS GarageBand and we'll close out by listening to this. Did you see the memo about this? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I have the memo right here. Love artificial intelligence? Excited by the explosive progress of integrated AI? I am. Join my private mailing list, The Memo. Did you get that memo? Yeah, I got the memo. Get priority access to my articles, videos, and behind the scenes tips as soon as they're released with a monthly or annual subscription. Yeah. Didn't you get that memo? Lifearchitect.ai slash memo. I have the memo.